played. He's only played 12 minutes. He's only taken one shot. He has been a non-factor in this game so far. Taylor, on the other hand, has to be a little bit frustrated. I, again, it was not intentional at all. It wasn't an idea that he was throwing the ball trying to get angry, but he did hit him, and as a result, the official has to call it. So Joseph Taylor back on the bench where he spent most of that Air Force game in foul trouble. He now has four. Four points for Joseph Taylor. And Keenan Young's go. A one-point lead now, 46 to 45 for BYU. You have to say, though, if you're Wyoming and they had four free throws, only taking half of them, you got to like that. Came out, came out of that relatively unscathed. Still down only by two. Sangondo, the poke that checks in for Taylor. Sangondo has two points on the night. A guy who doesn't get much action. Here's a foul underneath coming a big Trent play step. You know, it, it, it seems to me, James, that now that one was a little bit touchy. It looked, and it seems to me that maybe after the technical foul now, they're going to call a little bit closer. They actually did call that on Jimmy Balderson. Balderson now with three fouls up. Playstead, no fouls. And Keena Young, no fouls as well to the two big men. 